Welcome back, Amiibros and Amigals, to my channel. Today we have a brand new Nintendo DIY, and I love this DIY because it is very, very simple, and it's perfect, of course, for the holidays. So this is one way you can share your love of the Nintendo franchise by making your own glowing superstar. Of course, all materials will be listed down below in the description, so don't worry. I'll try to list all the materials off of Amazon, so all you have to do is click the link and it'll redirect you to the item and then place it in your cart. And by the time you know, it'll be at your home and you can start this very cute, easy DIY. So when it comes to the superstars themselves, you can actually use wooden stars or you can even find stars that are mirror-like. So there's a lot of options for you guys and I'll make sure to list those options down below. I tried to use various different types of materials so that way you can actually see what kind of look you want or what you're going for so it actually fits the decor of your room. When it comes to painting the eyes on, I actually am using acrylic paint. However, if you're not very confident in your painting skills, I actually recommend either printing out the superstars themselves on sticker paper or even using a Circuit Pro, which of course I will list all of that down below in the description. You have so many options when it comes to the actual superstar. So here, instead of actually painting it yellow, I decided to leave this wood-like finish. So again, it really depends on the type of look that you are going for, but regardless, whatever you use, it'll look so cute once you place it or hang it up in your room. When you go to your local craft store, you will have various options when it comes to different stars. I was lucky enough to not only find different types, but one that was actually completely covered in gold. That's the one that I actually preferred using the most. Once you've decided on your superstar, it's time to place them on your fairy lights. And these lights I actually got off of Amazon, so I'll make sure to link these exact ones down below in the description. All the fairy lights use two wires that run through the lights themselves. So when it comes to wrapping the stars, just separate those two wires and begin to wrap one wire first and then the other. As you can see, I used two different types of stars. Either way, just make sure that the wire is securely on the star. You do not have to actually use this technique. If you wanted, you can actually just glue two stars together and just completely skip this whole part of wrapping the stars in the wire if you want a cleaner look. All right guys, so here's a pro tip. You do not want to start in the middle. You actually want to put the star off to the side. That way you'll have enough wire to wrap the star itself. And the chances of it landing in between those two lights evenly is a high possibility. So again, do not start in the middle. You want to start off to the side. When you begin to wrap each one, you definitely want to avoid wrapping them the exact same way unless that is the look that you're going for. But I definitely wanted something a little bit more chaotic. Try to find a style that works best for you. If you happen to make any Nintendo DIY or any nerd DIY, please share it with me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. I would love to see your guys' creations because this is definitely one of my all-time favorite Nintendo DIYs. Alright guys, so the superstar that I'm showing you right now is a DIY that I actually did for Nintendo, specifically for their IG account called Nintendo Inspired. If you have the time, definitely check out Nintendo Inspired. I will also list that IG account down below in the description, but basically it's for lifestyle, clothing, or even DIYs that are relating to the Nintendo brand. So again, check that out down below in the description. 
I did make this for them and they actually posted it, but here it is again just in case if you missed that DIY. And this is a lot more accurate because instead of basically painting on wooden stars, you're actually painting directly onto the lights. So they glow like a superstar. It's a lot more accurate and it's so pretty. So if you ever see me stream on Twitch, you will actually see these in my background. That's how much I love this DIY. It is so cool at night to be playing my Nintendo Switch and then looking up and seeing a bunch of superstars. I highly recommend this to any parents or kids or anyone that loves Nintendo. Once again guys, the exact lights and all the materials will be listed down below in the description. So make sure that you guys check out all the links, including my social media, Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook, especially if you make any Nintendo DIYs. I would love to see your work and share it with the rest of the community. Make sure you guys subscribe to this channel. Don't forget to check out my Twitch in case you wanted to see live streams. And overall, I just appreciate your guys' support. Thank you so much, and I'll see you in the next video.